guys and welcome back to Thick Chick Thrift, honey, where you come for the fashion, but I hope you stay because you know I love you. Yay! Hello, 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 hello. Nice to meet you. Huh, sorry you can't get, come on. We love a good jam before we get started because we want to welcome all the new people. Honey, if you are new here, Welcome. Welcome to Thick Chick Thrifts where I show you all of my tips, tricks, DIYs, hair, whatever it is, girl, we get into something every week. So I love you and I thank you so much for stopping by. Before you leave, I truly hope that you hit that subscribe button and become a part of the family, honey, because we it's all love over here. Come on, bring it in. Bring it in, honey. If nobody told you today, I love you. I hope that you are having a spectacular day. And I, listen, you're doing a good job. You are doing an amazing job. Stop being so hard on yourself. Give yourself the same grace you give everybody else. So with that being said, everything's going to be all right. You just keep your head up, keep pushing, and know that he is God, honey. Talk to him about it and everything will work itself out. So thank you for stopping by. Make sure you share this video with somebody you love. If you ain't talked to him in a while, honey, share this video. I tell him for you, I love you, honey. And I hope that you guys really enjoyed this video. Now to my wonderful family members who are already in the family, honey, welcome the new people, honey. Get in the comments meet a new friend please be kind because that is all we share over here share the love share the kindness because we all know that god is love so make sure you keeping that positive energy going and we're gonna have some fun today y'all so this is going to be a part do it two dos uh what else we got that what it is we gonna do part two of our new york just I can't even find the words that I'm trying to say because I'm still on a high from the stuff that I found in New York. Y'all really enjoyed that last haul and I enjoyed finding all those things. So I love putting all of these things together. And like I said, I split it into two because I found so many dresses, so many different things for the first one. And this haul is going to be more so outerwear, jeans, um, wide leg pants slacks that type of aesthetic so if that is what you are ready to see honey we're not going to talk too long we're going to jump into the outfit of the day and the hair and then we're going to have some fun with this fashion i'm so excited and i have so many favorites let's just say that i have so many favorites i really hope you guys please let me know as we're going along honey let me know what's going on with the favorites up in here so I have too many, but you know, I'm going to tell you as we go along where these pieces came from. And if I just, I, I love them. So let's go ahead and jump into it, y'all. Cause I'm just, I get so excited. I know y'all can tell I love doing this. So I hope you guys are enjoying. Make sure you hit that thumbs up and let's go ahead and get started. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and start with the quick hair for the day. Of course, y'all know, I still have my drawstring ponytail for those of you who are new here. This is just a simple drawstring ponytail that I just kind of finagled and got it together for this week. I am about to go on another trip where we will be doing another deep dive and dig in the Los Angeles, Long Beach area. So listen, I'm dropping this right now. If you are in those areas, I will be in Long Beach in California. If you know of the Southern California kind of thrift route, hit me in the comments with some of the best thrift stores or the ones that I need to hit while I'm there. Cause I will be thrifting, honey. I ain't going there. Uh, just the love on folks, honey. I got to feel myself. So we will be digging and thrifting there. So please leave me comments 
today. When you get this, leave me comments on what stores and areas I need to hit while I'm there. So we're going to make this one. We're going to make this another fun, baby. This is going to be a worldwide thrift in a minute. So I love y'all. Hope you like the hair. I'll just show you really quick. You know, I always put a simple flower in my hair because that's just me. I was going to put two because of part two, but this is just the back. And like I said, it was just one of those really spirally curly ponytails and I kind of just separated it and I wanted it short on one side to kind of give that short, that asymmetrical look. But I hope you guys like it. Now let's get into the outfit and then we're going to jump into these fashions, honey. And I will be going a little faster because we got quite a few. I'm so excited. Let's go. Okay, so for the outfit, of course, y'all know I'm always thrifting. Now this particular outfit is a combination because I still do. I don't just thrift. For those of you who think all I do is thrift, I do not. I do not. There's a lot of stuff that I do not show you guys that I, I purchase like housing. If you want me to show you some of the things that I do for how I keep forgetting like y'all want to see stuff if I buy it for the house. If you do want to see when I find things though, I also do a vlog where I take you guys along with me. For those of you who are new, I work with children with autism and we are always out and about. But honey, when we pass a thrift store, your girl going in, I'm going in and I'm going to see what they have. And a lot of times I don't care if it's something for the house, whatever the case is, I show you pieces in those thrift stores that I just adore and I like to share them with you guys. So if you ever want to just see other pieces outside of clothing, and jewelry and shoes and accessories, things of that nature, check out the vlog because I always show you guys different things while I'm thrifting in the thrift store. So as the outfit of the day, this particular top, I recently went to, I think it was like the day before yesterday or yesterday, something that I'm going to a baby shower. So I went out and I found these pants thrifting a while ago and needed the right shirt. Let's just say that because I have plenty of shirts, but the ideas and Sometimes the vision, you know how you have a vision for something. When I found these pants, I kind of already had the vision of how I wanted to wear these. And when I tell y'all, this is a tip that I could give you for the rest of your life. Pray over everything. That's what I tell you. It's very simple. Um, because every time I go in a thrift store, I ask God to send me in there and cover me, but grant me what I need, what I need or even what I want sometime and things just pop up. I did not buy a lot when I went in this particular time. I think I only bought these pants, but it is a pair of, I'll step back. It is a pair of, I want to say, um, they're not necessarily gaucho, but like a wide leg palazzo type pant. And they were a two X and I am nowhere near a, no, it was one X. And a 1X still fits me kind of baggy now. So what I did was I took a pin, one of those, that dolphin pin. If you go back in the last video, I got this in New York at a thrift store. And it's just a huge pin that looks like in the shape of a dolphin. And I just kind of pinned the side up so they fit me exactly like I want them. See how wide? And it almost looks like a skirt if I just stand still or if i'm moving it still looks like a skirt but it's so comfortable because it is a pair of pants and they are super wide leg oh i love the fit on this now i will step to the side here so you can see a full view here i always step to the side because i like to put the view of me wearing things here but love these pants and i wanted to show how just a simple just a, I wanted something really crisp and clean and simple for the top. And I have plenty of shirts, but just did not have that vision. And so we went to Burlington and I found this shirt for $5.99. So I paid $4 for the actual pants. So once again, for under $10, your girl has made it all come together. God is so good. I'm so grateful sometimes like the things that pop up in my presence. Ain't of a God. It ain't nothing but him. So I hope you guys like this outfit of the day. I threw on a lot of my silver jewelry. I'm into, of course, as you guys can see, I'm a maximalist. So I try to throw on, I didn't throw on too much today, but threw on some rings 
and thumb rings and of course my bangles and one of my favorite watches that I got oh my gosh this watch is over 10 years old um but love this uh this particular watch so love this and this is my pop of color for the day but hope you guys like the simplicity of this outfit I can show some things sometimes I know are over the top but sometimes I just want to keep it really, really simple and feminine. But I hope you guys enjoy. Let me know what you think of the outfit of the day, honey. And we're going to jump into this fashion because it's a lot. And we need to go ahead and get it. Yeah, come on. I need y'all to see these. Okay, so before we get started, I will let you know once again, these pieces are like a hodgepodge of all of these things that I found in New York or the rest of the things that I found in New York and a couple of pieces sprinkled in of things that I found while I was here either before I left or right before I came back because y'all know I'm we always in the store. So we always in the streets. So this particular piece, um, I will let you know exactly where each piece came from and I will start with this amazing shirt now this or blouse I should say now this particular blouse look at the color y'all look how pretty and just just so gorgeous I love the colors on this this screams summer but at the same time you could definitely get away with this in the winter with a beautiful pair of distressed jeans or a pair of slacks even now I'm probably going to throw this on with a pair of uh, jeans that I have here just to show you what it looks like on but it's a really simple top if you ever in a situation where you have to go to your kids school uh, go to you can wear this to work it is it is cut kind of low here but I definitely would put a pin here if you want to pin it up and be a little more modest here there are a couple of buttons and it kind of gives corset at the bottom here but the cool part about it is there is some elastic as you can see there is elastic here so it's not sucking and and tugging on you and constricting you to make you be uncomfortable now I did get this from my local Goodwill as you can see the little bobbin here and it was the color of the day so our color of the day was 50 percent is always 50 percent off so i think i paid maybe 250 for this shirt um but love how flouncy and balloon style this particular sleeve is now it is long sleeve but it is a very thin material um and very i want to say it's not necessarily luxurious but it's from a brand called truth and it was made in India. So the quality of this is so soft. It's so weird. Like I, I would have to probably find the tag, but it is, it's a, it's like a, a cotton, but at the same time, more like a rayon, but it's so soft that it feels like it's not going to be that itchy material. And it has this elastic band here. So if I want to rouge it up and put all of my bangles on and honey, give God all the glory when my hands are raised, that is what we going to do. So I love this. And I'm probably, like I said, going to throw this on later and you'll see it with a pair of pants. So I'm just going to step to the side here, but the color is what stood out to me. Love, love, love the colors. So bright. And even on a winter day, if you want to just jazz something up and brighten it up, a crisp pair of pants, white, wide leg pants with this would be amazing with some heels now i would throw a pair of heels or booties on with this but like i said today we're just going to throw this on with a pair of dark denim jeans just so you can see what this top looks like on so we'll keep that as the focus hope you guys like this particular brand and like i said it's all up to you how modest you need this to be um, is where you would put the pin or not put the pin girl if that's your life honey if you about that life then honey that is you and you do you boo boo so I hope you guys like this one we're gonna jump into the next one and I hope you guys enjoy make sure you let me know what your favorites are as we go along so come on let's go okay my next couple of pieces which and I'm saying couple because it is a two-piece set now this particular set and I'll take it off the hanger for you was from one of that same New York unique thrift store. So I'm going to drape this one across my arm here so I can show you the top. This particular top is so 
It's so simple, but geometrically, I love this pattern. So look at the pattern first. I'll show you the pattern. And it's just this simple black and white, and I can break these two up to show you the top with something. You can wear the bottom with something different. But love how it has this wide elastic band here just to cinch you in. It has that, if I step back a little, it has that almost like an hourglass shape type to the shirt already. So it's going to be one of those shirts where it's just a simple top, a simple two piece set to get you along your day. You don't have to worry about ironing this. I literally threw this in the bag and it is just balled it up, threw it in the suitcase. Well, folded it up. I don't ball nothing up, but folded it up and put it in the suitcase. And it still looks like it has been ironed and everything. Now it is from, um, Adrian. Girl, if I, I, one day I'm gonna put my glasses on while we're doing this, but it's Adrian Vitadini. I think that's what that says. I'm not familiar with that brand, but whatever it is, honey, it is Quatlatehi. Loved it. So this one was a $19.99 special, but you guys, if you remember, at that unique thrift store, all the yellow tags were 75% off. So I paid less than $10 for this. And that is the only reason why I got it. Not the only, but I loved it and thought it would be one of those suits where if I have to go to my son, uh, my youngest is starting college soon. So if I have to go sit with a counselor, whatever the case is, and I want to look like somebody's mama, then this what you're going to go and look for, honey. I ain't trying to uh go out there like I ain't got no... I got kids and I got a man and I'm trying to keep all of them. So sometimes you have to wear what you need to wear to be presentable. And this is one of those outfits. The pants also have this elastic waistband and it also is more of a wide leg style. And you guys already know if you are familiar with me, you know, I love a wide leg pant because for me, it always it, it's always going to el uh, elongate you and I'm only five, three. So I'm going to take what I can get, whatever God will give. I'm going to receive it. So this two piece set is just the cutest and it's, it's just so comfortable. It is in a size extra large. And it's one of those, like I always say, no muss, no fuss, because that is the era I am in right now. Every blue moon, I feel like tricking the trickery and uh, going into the matrix and doing something wild and crazy. But sometimes you just, you just need things like this. Now, these do have pockets, as you can see. There is a pocket on this, which made it just 10 times, 10 times better than what it would have been if it not would not have had pockets. You could definitely throw this on with some sneakers. Or, like I said, if you need to go show off a little bit, then you put on a nice pair of little kitten heels or, or whatever the case is for you, honey, because that is about all I'm going to purr is a kitten heel. So I would throw on either some wedges or something with this. But for the most part, y'all know me. I would throw on some uh, wedge Nike sneakers and call it a day and still look like I'm about that business, honey, because I'm about God's business. And wherever I go, it will be blessed. And that is what it is. So I'm going to step aside here so you guys can see. And once again, the pants are the same exact pattern very simple but the further you are away or as I'm walking towards you it just looks like a black and white set so until you walk upon the actual material it doesn't look busy at all so if you're ever out and you see pieces like this honey snatch them pieces go ahead and do it so I love this and I cannot wait because when I'm trying it on you guys are seeing it with me so love this love this and you know i'm gonna crop it you you know i'm going to crop it because honey let me tell you something i ain't cropped nothing in 20 years so every time y'all see me i'm cropping something because that's what i got to give you right now and that's what i'm gonna give you so praise the lord somebody say it with me come on praise the lord so i hope you guys like this one let me know what you think now let's jump into the next couple of pieces okay so our next couple of pieces are going to be our pants or slacks or whatever the case is you will know where they came from but let's go ahead and get into it my next pair is a very beautiful colorful pair of i want to say not necessarily um they're not gauchos like y'all i please forgive me if if i keep showing the same style but 
I have to let you know that I shop for my body type. So if you notice that I keep showing wide leg pants and, and, and I don't wear a lot of uh, skirts and dresses because I shop for my body type. Now, one of the best things you can do is figure out your body type. So I have a more figure eight or pear shot pear shaped body at times. It just depends. Girl, it, look. It just depends on what I ate, what I'm eating, and what's going on in my life. But that is how I shop. So I always gravitate to things that I know flatter me. Now, please forgive me if a lot of these things you don't wear, but try to give them a chance. But first, figure out your body type and see what fits and just makes you look and feel amazing. And I seem to gravitate to... Even when I find slacks, I tend to gravitate more to. I don't look as pleasing to myself in a pair of slacks with a straight leg. Now, I do wear them every now and then, but for me, I have wider hips. So I like to stream them down more with a pair of, if you are the same or shape similarly, go for more wide leg because when you have wider hips here, you don't want to give off ice cream cone, honey. I know I'm sweet. I know they call me sugar mama, but I ain't trying to walk around looking like an ice cream cone. And that is just not the look I'm going for. So I always tend to, the hips are wider. So I step back. I tend to try to streamline those hips and play them down just a little, honey. But I know how to give it when the Lord, what the Lord said, I'm, I know how to give it when I need to, but I saw these in my local Goodwill and they were on sale for $6.99. And of course that was the regular price because I, if I'm, you have to watch the vlog. It may have been 50% off. It may not, but I know that if it wasn't, they were $6.99. But to me, they were so worth it because they have pockets. Of course, I'll show you that first, but the color, I don't own anything like this. I thought these slacks were so beautiful and it is a wider, just like the other pair, not necessarily a super wide leg like the ones I have on, but a wider leg. So whatever shoe I wear, like I said, it doesn't just cut straight in onto the shoe. So I love these and it has the elastic on the back. I'll show you here it has that elastic on the back, but it is a straight edge on the front. So it is a more clean line pair of pants in the front. Now the brand is New York and Company. Baby, I know that is a good brand. New York and Company. And like I said, I think I paid if $6.99 or either half of that. So anytime you see me um, at the local Goodwills, I try to show the prices of things also, but I'll try to start remembering to show that more. Um, but I always go in and before I even walk in, I show you guys the color of the day. So Love these. The pockets in the back are functioning, but you're not going to put much. I probably could get some gum or some lip gloss or something in there or some keys for that matter, which is perfect. But the front two pockets do work and they are functioning. But like I said, look at the color, y'all. Isn't that gorgeous? And my plan is to wear these or I, I, I envision them with a just a crisp white mock neck shirt or for now because it's summer just a crisp white t-shirt and a nice pair of sneakers or a pair of sandals which would be perfect it just depends on the event you are going to I always say that because I'm the girl I'm gonna wear sneakers anywhere that's just me but I always try to give you guys options on what you can pair with these items now this also in the winter would look amazing with or even now if I'm if I decided to, a denim shirt, a just a dark denim shirt that, that I want to say, not the light denim, but the darker denim. I don't know why the name is, is fleeting me, but a, dark, a lighter, um, a, just that middle denim, not the complete dark, but a middle denim because it is like that black and yellows and whites and teals. It is so pretty. But these do not have a lot of stretch, so I'm so glad that they are oversized. This is an extra large. Oh no, this is a medium, girl. This ain't. But in New York and Company, a medium is a real woman's medium, so these should fit me perfectly. 
they will fit a little more on the fitting side, but they won't flare down to my ankles like the ice cream, honey. We ain't serving. We ain't doing that. So I hope you guys like these. And I'm just going to throw it on with a crisp little white tee and a pair of sneakers just to give you guys an out. I'm pretty sure you're watching it here, but just to show you how these pants look on, I always try to show you when I find things, the reason behind them to show you the inspiration for it. So I hope you guys like it. Now let's get into another pair of our pants because I found quite a bit y'all. So let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, so my next pair is a pair of slacks, of course. And like I said, I gravitate to um, the type of slacks that flatter me. So, of course, this is probably going to be an all wide leg style type of pant. Um, just to broaden your mind if you're not or haven't been into them, just to give you a, an idea of how these types of pants look on um, a curvier. I am more a petite curvier. I'm still in a size large, medium now. I am a 167 the last time I was weighed, 167. Um, but I'm so grateful of my journey and where I've been and keeping that praise to God of eating properly. So I am smaller. I'm, I've lost almost 100 pounds, if not probably 100 pounds in the last couple of years. And I'm so grateful for where I am, but still learning how to um, wear things that flatter my body now because in my mind I still kind of look like that same person So I still find myself buying over oversized clothes, but I'm, I'm learning and I'm getting better. So this pair of pants <laughs> I found in my local thrift store and when I found them y'all you ever you if you are a thrifter or a shopper and you're ever in a store and you're on your way out and something just catches your eye I was on my way out the door and these were sitting at the end of a rack. It was almost like somebody had them in their cart. And then when they got toward the register, decided they changed their mind. And I'm going to tell you, God is amazing because I always say to myself, when people do that, that was God saying, put that back, put that back. Cause my baby, I need those for my baby. So go ahead and put them back. And here I come Moses and I saw it out of the corner of my eye because I'm always looking at for prints. And when I saw this print out of the corner of my eye, baby was on and popping. I couldn't get that, that basket to go fast as I needed to, to get close to what that was. Thank God nobody was in front of me, but it is this beautiful plaid pair. And can you see there's like some purples and some, um, it's almost like a lavender and purple and like a cream to it. And it kind of gives off a hue of black and brown. But because the purple is so dark, that's what it looks like. These are so comfortable looking and so soft. Now, this brand is ASOS. It is in a size 16. Here it is here. That is ASOS. And this pair is, they have the pleating on the front here. Now, this is just like if you have to go out to work, this is the kind of pants, baby, you you want to live in at work. They are so comfortable. And like I said, they have the pleating here. So it keeps it feminine. So you don't look like you have on just a pair of men's pants. That's too big for you. And they are a more wide leg style of pant. And like I said, I love that dusting look to a pair of slacks. I love it when I see a sister wear uh, a pair of these and have on a pair of heels and, you, and it kind of just get you, that little wind blow or something that or you walking down the stairs, baby. And the that dusting look is just phenomenal to me, honey. Women are some we are some beautiful creatures, baby. So these have the belt loops so you could definitely wear a belt. And I'm probably going to have to wear a belt with these because they are a size 16. But when I say soft, of course, the pockets are functioning. I don't know if I said that already. And there are no pockets on the back. So that's even better. I don't have to worry about all that extra material. Um, and I hope that you're seeing it here. Now, I am just going to throw this on with this lavender tank style, rib style tank that I have. And of course, if you want to, depending on where you're going, you throw on a beautiful black blazer or a cream blazer or a denim blazer, whatever the case is, or a uh, cardigan. 
in the winter or fall. And this is an outfit. Baby, somebody going to tell you something that day. So I love this type of, these types of slacks. I just think they're so classic and natural. And I kind of grew up in the 80s where this is the type of things women were wearing. But of course, they were tapered in a lot more. Um, and I kind of love that. Always love that look. But like I said, love that I can find them in that wide leg because that that's what fits me best. So I hope you guys like the way I styled them. Um, and like I said, we're going to keep it simple with this lavender because there is lavender in this particular pattern. It's very subtle, but it's so pretty. And you definitely could throw on a crisp white whatever top and be just the same. A button down crisp white top in the winter and go ahead and give it to them. Go ahead and do it. But love this, you guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. And we're going to jump into our next pair of pants. All right. So my next pair is just this amazing this y'all I don't like sometimes I wonder if y'all get as lucky as I get in the thrift store please let me know if y'all be winning like I do now I know I am in there more frequent than most people um and that could be uh one of the contributors to me always finding these really dope pieces but I really pray that you guys are getting just as blessed and lucky in the thrift store um because when I went in now, these came from my local thrift store also. Um, I recently purchased these, and here is the tag for them. And it is a denim pair, and these were $5.99, I think. $5.99 or $6.99, because they put a lot of times in my thrift store. These are hanging up with the dresses. So I always go through the dresses, not necessarily looking for dresses, but I always know they hang these with the dresses. All of my rompers and 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 overall sets that is the area if check your area a lot of times these are in the areas with the dresses but this is a pair of wide leg i want to say denim it is a very thin denim um but the it's it's an overall set but it's a little bit different because like i said it's a very thin and thin set girl look it is a very thin overall set and it is trimmed in this cream trimming or, or thread. And the back is more of that open style, as you can see. Now, when I wear it and I turn around, you'll be able to see it a little bit better. But you get more of your shirt from the back in this one. And it's just this really simple, really cute overall set that has elastic in the back. So it's going to... Um, I actually, in my last vlog, if you want to see, I went in the dressing room for the first time. I Most of the time, I don't even try a lot of this stuff on. But wanted to go in the dressing room before I start buying these pieces because I'm noticing because I've lost so much weight, I have to start trying a lot of this stuff on. So I have on my workout. You always see me with my workout pants and um, um, shirt on. And I just take the t-shirt off and I always have a sports bra on. That way, whatever I'm trying on, I can just put on top of that. If that is a tip I can give you, you always want to go to the thrift store comfortable and able to put on, have on something you know, if it'll fit on top of what you have on, you can fit it. So um, a, a pair of workout pants and a, a sports bra is, is so perfect because none of that is touching your skin, whatever the case is, um, as far as your pants and in your areas, you are good to go. So this particular overall set has the ruching in the front and the pleating this is the daintiest cutest little overall set um it looks just like all of the other ones i have it is just denim of course the pockets are functioning and here is the wide leg to it all and it is not a super super wide leg but baby it is wide and i love it it I love to that peekaboo in a shoe. So that is another reason why I love a wide leg pant. Uh, you can wear these with some sandals. Now I did get these. Um, I had these. I got these from the thrift store and they were brand new. And they, the brand is Shoe Republica. And it's the cutest pair of just sandals. 
and the platform has got to be about three inches. But love to wear things like this with these wide leg pants. So I still get that dusting, but it lifts me up higher because for some, no, I'm going to say for some reason, but I know I'm a petite girl and at 5'3", most pants always drag on the floor. So just like these would have been dragging, dragging, but I have on a at least inch and a half pair of wedge or platform sneakers. So that helps out a lot. But these also were dragging a little, so I'm definitely going to have to wear a pair of platform something with these. But honey, you could play these up or down. I could wear a pair of heels with this, with that beautiful blouse, and kind of give off that tomboy chic look. Just fantastic. Fantastic. I love these. I found these and was so happy in the store when I saw them. And I think I paid regular price for these, which is like, like I said, $6.99, but I thought they were so, so worth it, but it is a light denim. And this is the color you want. I was talking about chambray. Is that chambray to wear with that colorful pair of pants, just to have that little, um, different girl today. The devil is a lie. Somebody we going to keep going because I'm too excited. So I'm going to calm down and get it together. But this pair of pants and this chambray color is so pretty to me. But look, I, look how wide and just glorious that is. But I love it. I hope you guys love this. I am just over the moon about these. Now I'm thinking of wearing these on my trip, like wearing them in the airport. Because I think these would be so comfortable with just a simple t-shirt and a pair of platform sneakers. I'm still debating on, I'm one of them girls, honey, I got an outfit. I don't wear clothes. I have an outfit for the airport. So I like to look really cool and uh, comfortable, but at the same time presentable on my trip. So I'm thinking about wearing this one. Let me know if I should wear this to the airport with a cool little t-shirt, a graphic tee, and a nice pair of platform shoes but i hope you guys like the way i styled it now i may throw it on with that beautiful blouse just to show you that you can dress that up or down or dress this up or down or we may just throw it on with this particular tee here i do have this gorgeous shirt that i found while thrifting at my local dav and it is that squared off cigarette style top and I love this. I don't know about y'all, but I am really digging this particular style of shirt. And it's more squared off. And it falls right at my waistline. It does have a zipper in the back. So it is a dressier style of shirt. And I only paid $2.98 for it. So I may throw this one on with it. Um, I only got it that shirt. Well, not only got it, but I have a lot of um, brown. I want to start wearing my Gucci purse and my Gucci hat a little bit more. So I'm starting to look for more browns and tans so I can start wearing those because it's just sitting on it. That's one brand. I just, I don't know. I, I do not always gravitate to, um, not for no particular reason, but I have a hat and a, a purse and some shoes that I need to start wearing. So I just decided to grab that particular shirt, but hope you guys like it. Now let's go ahead and jump into, I think it's my last pair of pants, but let's go ahead and jump into it. Cause I think these, I left these last cause they are my favorite. So let's see. Okay. So my last pair of pants and baby, yes, I did save these for last because once again, I am a creature of habit and these, let me take these off the hanger for you. This pair of pants is when I say outstanding and it is all the rage right now, but I grew up wearing these all my life. So, um, I'm so glad they came back around, but these cargo pants, I got these in New York at that particular thrift store, the unique thrift store. So this particular pants was a brand new, when I say smack brand new, still has the tags from Forever 21. Um, everything is still tagged. This is a size 16 oversized. They did have a 14, but um, if you're not familiar with cargo pants, a lot of them 
nowadays do not have stretch now back in the days there was no stretch at all and then all of a sudden they start doing a little giving you a little more uh stretch with the material of the denim this is a when i say real cargo style pants these are heavy um not too heavy but these are a heavier true denim pair of pants now these were i'll show you the tag here these were 24 24.99 but if you remember or if you go back and watch the green tags were 25% off so I think I paid like 20 bucks for these um, but to me so worth it they were brand new never been worn everything is intact there are like got to be like 10 pockets on this thing um, the pockets of course are all functioning there are pockets in the front pockets in the back pockets down the side on each side of the pant but the most important part that I absolutely love is that they are a super wide leg pair. Now y'all know with a shirt like this, when I say would pop off, um, I'm looking for a blue and white uh, top like this. So I may go back to either Burlington or Char Ross because they do have similar styles of clothing, but I would love to find a very similar blue and white stripe type of shirt if not a simple graphic tee with some sneakers i could put this on and i may put it on with that dressier shirt um you're gonna see how i style it here but love these pants it is a darker denim and you guys can tell i stray away from lighter denims now the only reason why i like that chambray on those is because they are oversized and wide leg anytime I wear fitting jeans most of the time they are always a dark denim because like I said that is a more slimming um, flattering color for my body style or body type so this is the perfect color this dark denim and the it's trimmed in like this white trimming or white thread which sets it off and these are so stinking dope I cannot wait to wear these. Um, I have this gorgeous little top that I got from the Rainbow Shop in New York. Um, this is one of those, just says New York on it. I like when I'm in certain places, like when I go to Cali, I'm hoping I find a, a whole bunch of Los Angeles or California tees and tanks or whatever. But love finding pieces that this is what every time I wear it will always remind me um, of my trip to New York but love the trimming. And I thought this would look perfect with those cargo pants and my Gucci sneakers. I have some Gucci sneakers that are gold um, and yellow and have a yellow trim to them. So love this um, and think that that would be so perfect with these pants. So I'm probably gonna throw this on with this particular pair of pants just to show you guys how this fits. So I hope you're seeing it here. But if you are a cargo girl, um, Forever 21 always has those cargo pants, but they are $49, $50 in Forever 21. So to get, to get a brand new pair for 20 bucks was so worth it to me. I really hope you guys enjoy the pants series. Now let's go ahead and jump into this outerwear, y'all, because I think this is my favorite. This, come on, let, let, let's just go ahead and look at them and then you tell me if I was right. Okay, y'all, so as for outerwear, like I said, we've already been through the pants, the sets. Let's go ahead and get into this outerwear, y'all. I know it's not that time of the year yet, but it is coming up really fast. I don't know about y'all, but time has been going by, baby. And when I say fast, fast. And I need to go bring these to get them clean um, at the cleaners. So I like to look for outerwear out of season, because that is when you're going to find it the cheapest. So I was in my local thrift store. It was a Goodwill. Um, if you go on the last vlog, you will see when I found this. I was in my local Goodwill and, and by the Lynn Haven Mall area in Virginia Beach, if you're ever in this area. So this, baby, what, let me tell y'all how good God is. I have been stalking this thing on Poshmark. Now I found this on Poshmark and young, the young lady had it for $39. So she wasn't charging a lot of money 
um, from the get-go. It is by Steve Madden. I'll go ahead and show you the deets really quick. It is by Steve Madden. It is lined. It's fully lined. And I think that this, y'all, listen, when I first started, I showed capes so much. They are so flattering. I don't care what your body type is. Capes are so flattering. So when I saw this on Poshmark, I was all in. But I just was not ready to give nobody $39 for something I wanted to try. It is a more varsity styled cape. I do not own one. I own many capes, but not a varsity style cape. Now this one has a design on the back. And I just thought it was so simple, but beautiful. It has a lot of flowers and I think that's a dragon. But I just thought it was very subtle and beautiful um, with those flowers. But love how they have it trimmed in the white here, but also on the sleeves. And you kind of just throw this on and I'm probably just going to throw this on. I'll let you see here with just either a pair of that, that dark denim, just so you kind of see what it looks like on. It is does have functioning pockets in the front. And all you do is drape this over your outfit and put your hands through. And sometimes you don't even have to put your hands through. Um, you can just drape it over like a, literally a cape. But love this, it is gray and black. Y'all, I paid $4.99 for this. I paid $4.99 for this. So I was so hyped in the store when I saw this. Now I plan on putting some form of a pin on here, um, but I love how this looks. And here is the, the tag from my local Goodwill. But can you imagine like seeing this and then finding out that you it, it was half price of $8? So I got, I paid $4 for this. I'm gonna get this clean and baby, this winter is going to be, the sneakers I have on go so perfect with this. I have on a pair of platform, black and white, Nikes. Oh my gosh. When I tell you I'm going to wear this out, ain't going to be nobody's business and I'm going to do it. So hope you guys like this one. Not going to spend too much more time on it, but let me know what you guys think. Would you wear something like this? If you've never done it, you need to give capes a try. I love these. Now let's get to our next piece of outerwear. Okay. So my next piece, when I say fantastic, fabulous, like Come on and give me the words. It is amazing. I also got this from my local thrift store. And like I said, I'm always collecting things along the way and I try to put them together with um, like-minded or, or similar items. And I recently found this at my local thrift store. And let me know if I'm going too fast in the comments, but I mean, these are out of wear. I don't want to spend too much time on it, but really want to show you how awesome these are. This. I'm gonna let you get into the color first. Look how gorgeous. It is another varsity styled, I wanna say jacquard, like it, it's flowered. It's so different and gorgeous. Look how paisley, it kinda looks paisley, but it's not because those are flowers and it's trimmed in this beautiful pink and green. And the flowers are like this blue, pink, green, red. They're all in it, but it is not a bright in your face. It's a very bold pattern, but not a bright all in your face type pattern. It is from the brand Char Charlotte Russe. But I thought this was so different. And it kind of gives off, um, you ever see those Asian uh, dresses that the beautiful women wear over there or the, the the shirts or kimono type style this is what the material gives off that is what that color uh and the material gives when you look at this the zippers um are, are trimmed in gold and the pockets are functioning now i'm just going to try this on i'm going to step on the side here and just try it on with those same denim pants so most of the outerwear you will see me try on with those denim pants just to give you an idea of what this looks like on but we're not going to spend too much time on this i just and this was only six night six ninety nine i think it was six ninety nine so either i paid half i think this was two vlogs ago when i found this one but i definitely showed you um the color of the day and the price so you will find 
Either I paid $6.99 or I paid half of that. So love of this. $3.50. Whatever the case is, I did not pay a lot. And I think I'm going to get so much wear out of this this winter. I can wear this with a skirt with some because it's going to dress up or dress down depending on the shoes that I wear. But I think, let me show y'all. I think these are fabulous. Now, these are a pair of heels that I found recently um, at my local thrift store. And I love the back, how that is bedazzled on the heel. And it is a three inch heel, but I'm waiting to wear these. And it has this straps, this long straps here, and they go and they tie around your ankle. But I'm waiting to wear these because they make um, these things that you put underneath the ball of the shoe. And it kind of gives you a little more um, tension off of the ball of your feet. So I think these would go fantastic with a wide leg pair of jeans with these. Or you can throw these on with a pair of, throw this on with a pair of sneakers. It just depends always on where you are going. But I love this, y'all. And I hope you guys like this. I hope you like the way I styled it. Very simple. We're just going to throw it on with a white tee either a crisp white tee. Um, and like I said, those dark denims, but just wanted to show you that you do not have to wait till the winter to start looking for winter items. It's always cheaper. And I think that's why I paid three. I think I paid three fifty because it is, it was one of those things where it was 50% off. They're trying to get rid of that winter stuff so they can bring in all of their new winter apparel. So love, love, love this. And once again, I'm showing you the colors because that is what sold me. And I think this is just so dope. I really hope you guys like this haul. This, my last piece I'm about to show you is my favorite of all. And I'm about to show y'all why. So let me get it together and then I'm gonna show you. But let me know what yours has been so far. If not, just say all of them, cause then you'll be like me. But this next piece, I'm gonna put you over the top here. Come on, let's go get it. Okay, so my last piece, y'all, we have made it to the end. I thank you so much. You are so amazing, but I'm so glad you waited because this last piece is when I say, I find, every now and then there are pieces that you find and then there are pieces that you find. And this is one of those items. Now, this is another cape styled or kimono um, styled cape. I could definitely wear this as a dress or you can wear it as a just a simple cape. Now, I'm going to probably throw it on with just throw it over those denim uh, pants just to show you what it would look like. Now, if you can imagine these with this and a denim mini skirt, baby, let me tell you something with a crisp white tank or, or, or cami ready ain't the word so I'll show you the color of this and it is this burnt orange style it's not too dark though but it's like this beautiful orange and gold and brown and cream and it gives off a shimmering effect just like the shoes but it is this wide armed kimono styled cape and I'll step back a little bit more so you can see and it falls right below, I wanna say your bum bum, right above your knees. So this, when I say, fant I cannot believe somebody put, sent this to the thrift store. Now this is from um, a brand called Hot in Hollywood. And if I'm not mistaken, Hot in Hollywood, if I'm not mixing it up, was uh, there was a, one of the famous producers, his wife makes her own clothes, used to have her own clothing line. And I think it was called Hot in Hollywood. But this seems to be her more um, upper echelon apparel. It is gorgeous. It almost looks gold in the inside. This is fabulous. Like, I'm just going to step to the side and let y'all see how this looks on. It, it, it's, it's better shown than it is told. Now, this is, when I say gorgeous all the way around, the back is just as beautiful. Now it does have a little holes in it 
where a belt should have went. So I'm almost certain there was some form of a belt, but I can just throw on any type of small skinny belt with this and turn this into a dress. I may, if I have time, throw that on so you can see what it looks like. But I hope you're seeing here how fabulous this thing really is. It is so simple, yet it is so chic and becoming and so feminine and flirty. I would definitely wear this with, um, you could now I will wear a pair of jeggings with something like this. Um, that, that skinnier leg with the heel, because then you're taking more of the attention up and it just doesn't look like you, like I said, y'all already heard me talk about the ice cream, but this will bring a lot more attention up. So you're not focused on, and it breaks up the shoe to the, uh, the top versus just you looking at me coming and all you see is that. So love this y'all. Please let me know what you think about this. Now this was one of those pieces from the unique thrift store in New York. I paid, uh, it says $9.99 here, but like I said, the greens were 25% off. So I think I paid $7 and change for this, either $7 and change or almost $7. I know it was in that particular range. So I love this. Now I am taking this on my trip because um, if we decide to go out to dinner, um, I think this would go amazing with, like I said, a either a denim skirt or a, I don't own a gold dress or a, of any sort, but I think a denim skirt with a crisp white tank uh, would, I would bring it out and it really would dress it up, but at the same time I would be comfortable and either I can wear those types of shoes or I really, I really don't have, I think, I think I may do a sandal with these just to keep it dressier. Um, let me know in the comments. I think I should do more, a more dressier sandal. I think those would be perfect with this out, with this particular outfit that I have in my head. So make sure you're checking out the vlog, um, next week. So you can see all of the things that I found in California and, um, how I ended up putting this together. Cause I really want to take this with me um, on my trip. So I love this. I hope you guys like this. And like I said, for $7, like really, and I can wear this as a dress or just drape it over. California does not get cold at all, but something like this, it does chill and get a little cooler at night. I can throw this over and be just fine. So love this. You guys, let me know if I won on this one. Cause I think I won with this one. It is a very thin, but has some weight to it, but it, it is a thinner um, cape because those capes can get heavy, but this is gorgeous. Now it does not have pockets. There is that gold in the, on the side here. This one does not have pockets, like I said, because that's why you could definitely wear it as a dress because it's not gonna give all that extra bulk. But I love this one. I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul. This. I have every haul to me has just been getting better and better. And to me, that is just how God is. Every time you encounter him, every time you ask, it just gets better and better and better. The more you put your trust in him, everything just seems to, in, it, it just, it's like a heightened sense. It just gets better. So I hope you guys let me know if you have been enjoying these vlogs and these hauls and try-ons as we have been going along. I hope that I have been growing and getting better as we have been going. It is almost my three-year mark. I am almost at my three-year mark. So I feel like I have been pushing myself to do um, other styles and different things. So I hope if you have a comment or if you have something you want me to try make sure you leave it in the comment section so we can keep this going because i want to keep you guys just as engaged as i am if you have like i said if you have something you want me to try or i haven't done yet just leave it in the comment section i read all of your comments i have to do all of my responses this week i wanted to wait till i got on a plane so i have i can be productive so i really love you guys hope you enjoyed this haul this piece I think is my favorite, but let's get to my favorite part of the video, y'all, because you know I love you. All right, so I love you, love you, love you. I love you guys to pieces. Baby, let me tell you something. I love you to life. 
that is what I love you too. I speak life over you all. I speak life over myself and my family and friends and which you are. So I love you. And I truly hope that you thoroughly enjoyed this video. I have finally got all of these pieces together like I wanted them. And I hope you like the way I styled them. I thank you so, so much for coming back every week to rock with your girl to see what I got going on over here. I appreciate you guys so, 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 so much. I could not do this if you didn't watch it. So I thank you so much. And I, God knows my heart. And I really hope that you guys can feel the love that I have for you and the appreciation that I have that you keep coming back, honey. We're not at the millions, but the ones who are here, I feel you and I love you and I thank you and I praise God for you. And I, if there's anything you know about this channel, we love on each other here. So if you have a comment, you need somebody to pray for you. You want to meet a new friend, be kind in the comments, introduce yourself to somebody new, say hey to somebody. It's all right over here, honey. We don't do that over here. We are a family here. So make sure if you are new that you have already hit that subscribe button. If you have been here for a while and you don't know if you hit it, hit that subscribe button and make sure the most important thing y'all can do to help me, please hit that share button. It's right there at the bottom right there. And you can just share this on all your social media or you can share with a friend because we're really trying to grow this because my message behind all of this fashion is God. So I hope that you are feeling the positive energy and the light that God keeps shining through me. I, I pray my one prayer is that you see him through me and that we all see us through his eyes. So I love you. And I hope that you have us. No, we're not hoping we are going to have a spectacularly blessed healing abundantly just full of joy this week. I pray it over us in Jesus name. I hope y'all have an amazing day though. Speak it, speak positive. It's going, it is a good day. I ain't going to be, it is a good day. So I love y'all and I will see y'all God willing next Sunday. Wait, I'll be in the sky. So I won't be doing another video. So next Sunday, if you can, please make sure you check out, um, I'm pretty sure I'll be posting something, but I will not be doing a video next Sunday because I'm going to be all over moving around, honey. So make sure you go back and catch up on any of the vlogs or any of the hauls that you missed or one of your favorites. Go back and check it out or leave me comments because I will be getting back to y'all. But I will see y'all. Matter of fact, not this Thursday, but the following Thursday with the vlog of my whole trip. So keep me in prayer. We have a safe trip, safe travels, and make sure you leave me a comment if I need to hit one of them thrift stores in that those areas. So I will be in Southern California and I'm so excited, but I'm not sure exactly what I will post Sunday. I don't think it'll it be a vlog or a try on, but we, we might try to post something. So I might go live. We will see. I won't be able to do it for long, but I might do something just to go um, just so I can communicate with y'all because I love y'all so much. So let me know how we should handle that Sunday. If you are available and can chat it up for a few minutes, let me know because we might just do a really quick live on Sunday if I'm not too busy. I love y'all and I just to pieces. I do, I do, I do. And I'll see you guys, God willing, when we come back from our trip. So it's a good day. It's a great day. And make sure you give God praise. I'll see y'all later. Bye.